so whenever somebody say i am using sap build which means it does not require too much coding experience is as simple as that sap build is all about low code no code development yeah so if you think about or talk about build it means low code no code okay so what is sap build in one line definition if your manager ask you again what is sap build how do you define it sap build is a user friendly low code no code platform within sap btp so you cannot use sap build as a separate software which you install in your laptop like you know microsoft powerpoint or uh, like you know uh, calculator you can't do that it's part of btp platform it is offered on btp platform it's not an independent product it's part of btp platform as a service offering it is designed to empower users to create customize enhance applications automate workflows and build business process and build build business websites without the need of a advanced coding skill so that's the main concept of sap build we want to give a tool we want to give a framework we want to give a set of libraries we want to give a set of things to in the hand of everyone everyone means everyone someone who have coding experience or someone who don't like to code or don't have coding experience they also can learn they also can contribute now what does the portfolio of build includes sap build portfolio includes three major components as you can already see on your screen the first component is called sap build apps so the use case as you see is to create application for example i want I, i was taking a lorry example for entering lorry detail so whenever a truck enters of raw material in my factory i want to scan the barcode the number plate information and push this data to a database is as simple as that so this kind of an application even a non professional developer can also build yeah so this is the first part then the second part is called sap build process automation to automate any business process yeah so uh, we will also be discussing that much in detail in the coming lectures so sap build process automation where you will automate the business process yes you have a business process which is spread across multiple users and multiple department you can define and design that business process graphically with the drag drop again doesn't require coding skills the last but not the least is called sap build work zone which is the topic for our today's session it is to create a business site suppose you created 10 applications and then you created five business processes yeah so your goal is to give access to these 10 applications and the monitoring of these five business process so how do you do that so your end users yeah the people who will actually use the application they need some kind of an entry point to all these applications they need some kind of entry point to also monitor the business processes yeah and take action on business process suppose there's a business process called leave request so an employee apply a leave and a manager has to approve now where will manager go and approve this leave yes so or where will an employee go and apply the leave so we build an application to create leave request and then we need to have some kind of an application where manager can view all the leave request came from employee and approve that so for that we need many applications yeah leave request application leave approval application or a uh, checking the some kind of action item is pending on my name that kind of application so all of these application comes and integrate at one one stop shop that's called build work zone so it's the work zone of the end user where end user will come connect in the morning and work all day throughout this build work zone so it was formerly known as sap fury launch pad in the cloud it is it was renamed by sap to build work zone so that's the topic for today but the main idea here is no coding is required yeah so what sap is messaging here is with low, with sap build is you don't need to have any coding experience or coding knowledge anybody without any coding knowledge with little bit of training they can utilize these tools and build end to end applications